Hi well, everybody, Jerome Blackie here again, your club coach. I'm also your sponsorship coordinator, by the way, as well. You can probably see I'm back down at the club, catching up with Belinda. But before we start and talk about why I'm here with Belinda, you should know this lady is incredible. She is our club secretary. She's pretty much the backbone of this club, right? She does everything. I'm not talking just, you know, some people talk about the glue of the club. She's not the glue. Glue doesn't cover it. She's the pure and utter backbone of this club, okay? Right, just wanted to get that out of the way. So if you see her down at the club, give her a pat on the back, maybe even get her a coffee, okay? Like a coffee? What do you, what's your order, Linda, by the way? Hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. Sorry, don't get her a coffee. <laughs> get her a hot chocolate. I've just learned something today as well. As I said, down at the club, catching up with Belinda, because she, as well as being the secretary of the club, is also one of the sponsors of the club. She's got Chatterby um, Speech Path. But what is it? Sorry. Chatterby Speech Pathology. Thank you. And so what do you do? What's, what's it about? It's not about, you don't make honey, do you? It's no. Like okay. <laughs> I definitely don't. Uh, yeah, Chatterby is a, a play off my name because I mm -hmm. like to chat as a speech okay. pathologist. And the B is obviously for my first initial, which is Belinda. Oh. Um, so I am a speech pathologist. I've been doing it for 13 years. I work with kids, uh, predominantly primary school age kids because that's that's my jam. That's where I, I um, feel the most comfortable and make feel like I make the most difference. Um, so I tend to help kids with their speech and their language, help them communicate and get what they want to say across because talking is something that is very important to me. Super. So you've got three kids yourself. I do. So probably pretty easy for you to relate to children in primary school years, yeah? Uh, very easy to relate. I come from a very large extended family, so I've always been around kids and helping with kids and involved with kids in, in some capacity. Um, so yeah, that's that's what makes me happy and, and I love seeing the kids make all the improvements that they um, they do with me. Excellent. So what would a, let's say I was a, a 10 year old coming to you for help? Yeah. Yep. Cause Probably could, I don't know, sometimes I am like a 10 year old. 10 year old coming to you for help. What would a, a, a basic session look like? Or? So yeah, well, it would depend on what our goals were. Yeah. So if you know you were working on some of the speech sounds, so THs or Ss, lisps tends to be quite a common one um, at around that age, we would do lots of games. So I'm really good at losing at card games, which is fabulous <laughs> with kids because they love to win and they think it's hilarious when I lose. Um, so we tend to make things as fun as possible because Obviously, as a mum of three kids, I know that kids learn the best when they're having fun, when they're enjoying themselves, and it sinks in a lot quicker and a lot um, better than if I was just doing rote learning with them. Uh, so we might play a game of Go Fish or Snap or Memory or things like that so that we practice all the words and we put them in sentences and things like that. Um, if we were doing a language approach side of things, we might look at creating sentences and talk about what they've been doing on the weekends and things like that, and then working on memory skills as well. Okay, so would I be right in saying it? it's not like homework, it's it's fun, it's fun play, it's interactive, and you get your job done by letting the children enjoy themselves, yeah. teaching along the way. So it's Absolutely. very clever, isn't it? It's a very clever approach. I, I try yeah. to. They like to keep me on my toes. No day is ever the same, yeah. and no approach works for the same kids. So Excellent. I'm very good at thinking on my toes and coming up with all sorts of crazy analogies to help the kids understand how they need to do things in a memorable way that makes it stick. Excellent. Now I've learned heaps because I didn't know any of this myself. So that's awesome, thank you. Right. I've worked this closely with you and didn't even know this. So that's really, really <laughs> great. So that's cool. So um, you'll be able to find Belinda's details in the comments above and the links below, wherever we're posting stuff. Sounds like a great opportunity. You know, get on down to have a chat to Belinda if your troll's having issues in any way, mate. No, she's not just here Happy as a, to have a chat. Yeah, she's not just here looking after the club. She's here looking after the children in the community as well, which is absolutely awesome. So thanks guys, thank you Belinda, great, no great catching up with you, cheers. You too. <laughs>